Hey BC, I'm back. I've been away for a little while. Uh, just life, life happens I think. Um, I've been a little bit sick but I'm, I'm trying to get over it. Uh, but I thought it was important that I jumped in here and made a, a response to Maggie's uh, True Colours thread. Hey Maggie, how you doing? Uh, great idea for a thread by the way. Um, I've really enjoyed watching everybody else's uh, responses so far. Uh, look forward to watching a few more. Um, I've got a few to get through here. I've, I've picked out some cool stuff. Uh, but before I show it off, um, I just wanted to reiterate some of the things that a lot of you guys and girls have said um, about the, the VC, um, about how it's a fantastic community full of really great people, um, really giving people. Uh, it's just a lot of fun. So if you haven't, if you haven't gotten involved yet, um, mark my words, you'll have a lot of fun if you do. Uh, so please, please jump in and have a go. Uh, in the meantime, uh, there's a bit to get through, so let's, let's get into it. Starting off with, hey Maggie, I've, um, I've picked out your favourite band to start off with. How about that? Here we go. Metallica, Fame 25. This is a Swinging Pig uh, bootleg of their performance uh, as a part of the 25th anniversary of the Rock and Roll, Rock and Roll Hall of Fame uh, in 2009. Check out the gatefold. And it's on dark pink. That's, that's a real Metallica kind of colour, isn't it? Um, really fantastic uh, custom labels. Uh, so that's, that's what we're getting started with here. A little bit of pink for you, Maggie. How about that? Alrighty, next up is a single from uh, one of the really cool bands at the moment, uh, Graveyard. They've got a, a single out on their latest uh, record, Lights Out. And the single's called Goliath. And this is on really dark purple vinyl with really cool uh, custom labels. I think there's only about 100 of these in the world. Um, so I'm, I'm breaking up the good stuff for you, Maggie. There's, there's some surprises in here too, but um, not a bad way to start, huh? Alrighty, continuing with the singles. Here's a 12-inch single from 1987 uh, from Joe Satriani from his record Surfing with the Alien. This is a single for Always With Me, Always With You. Uh, I'm a huge Joe fan. Uh, this was actually personally autographed by him. Uh, so this is a really cool uh, bit in my collection. I'm really happy to have this. And this Always single will always be on clear vinyl. Sweet, huh? Alrighty. I'm not much of a picture disc fan myself. Uh, I've got a few, few in the collection. This one is probably my favourite. This is Chula Homo by The Black Keys. Just thought this picture just looked really funky. Uh, the colours are great. And it looks really, really nice spinning around. Go check it out. What would some true colours action be without showing some living colour? Uh, this is Time's Up. This is on some really nice neon lemony goodness. Uh, pretty funky pink labels too. Uh, this looks really good in, in person, it probably is not picking up on the camera as well, but uh, it's really quite a striking colour, so I like this one a lot. Alrighty, next up, is the Fame Sessions from George Jackson. I heard about this guy off Brandon, uh, Mr. Hall of Fame. He showed a CD of George Jackson from, from these Fame Sessions. Uh, this is a compilation LP of, of those sessions that he recorded uh, back in the 60s, I believe. George Jackson was a Absolutely fantastic uh, soul and R&B uh, songwriter and performer, uh, but he before he actually wrote songs for other artists for the most part. And uh, if you can find this, go grab it because he's absolutely brilliant. And this comes on uh, green. It's actually one of my favourite vinyl colours. Um, the labels are pretty sick too. I like it. Alrighty, the next few here I'm going to show uh, for Rob Penix. Vance VK and Robert Z. Here we go. A little bit of Zeppelin action. Uh, Led Zeppelin 1. This is actually a Spanish, uh, Spanish pressing. And this is on pink. A uh, nice really dark pink with a bit of marbling in it. Uh, which I think looks really, really great with this Atlantic label. 
uh, and it's Spanish, so it's, it's even cooler. Alrighty, next up is a, a Mexican pressing, a Mexican import pressing of Led Zeppelin II. And this is on a really nice apple green colour, which again, I think looks really nice against the, uh, the green and red, green and orange Atlantic label. Nice, huh? Alrighty, here we have uh, an Israeli pressing, import pressing of Led Zeppelin III, uh, all the way from Tel Aviv. And uh, again, this is, I'm really happy to have this one, really lucky. And this is a really dark plum, I would call it plum colour, uh, which is pretty flash, I think. Alright, I've shown this one before. This is uh, a bootleg called Dallas Trampled Under from uh, March in 1975. Yeah. How sweet does this look? Uh, it's like a sky blue with black splatter through it. Uh, it's probably one of the most striking records that I own. Alrighty, I've got to show some Floyd, haven't I? This is uh, Division Bell from 1994. This one's on blue. I love the labels on, the, on this one. Alrighty, here's one that I, uh, I recently sent Fitzy. Uh, Rush 1974. This is on a really funky uh, bi-coloured um, LP. Uh, orange and it's a, it's a dark plum burgundy sort of colour. Um, which really looks fantastic against the, the custom labels I think. Alrighty, next up we've got a box set here. Uh, Slash. Live in, uh, live in Stoke, in the UK. Uh, this is with Miles Kennedy uh, singing. Disc 1 is on white. Check that out. Disc 2 is on a, a transparent yellow, which looks fantastic. And the third and final disc is on this really nice dark blood red colour. Alrighty, Hiss and Gin Blues by Graveyard. And mine's on this, uh, another bi colour. It's, it's sort of like a teal and caramel colour. It's really sweet. Alrighty, I saw Miko actually show this one in his response to your contest, Maggie. Uh, this is a band called Jess and the Ancient Ones uh, from Mighty Finland. Uh, check out the check out the uh, cover on this thing. Look at that. And uh, Miko's was red. Mine's green. Alrighty, here we have Orchid Capricorn. This is a really sick uh, violet sort of colour with a bit of uh, blue and white and red marble thrown in for good measure. Looks really great. Alrighty, some of you have seen this before. It's always good to break this one out, I think. Mammoth Mammoth, Hell's Likely Volume 3. A great uh, hard rockin' band from Australia. This one looks like a standard issue, but if you look at the back here, this is a 2LP two, two version. A special 2LP Australian version, mate. <laughs> Not really. And this comes on really nice transparent orange. Matches the labels nice, I think. Alright, and finish up, Maggie, here we go. Mammoth Mammoth Volume 2. And this one's also on the same transparent orange. Really nice colour. Alrighty, there we go. Thanks for checking in and checking out uh, my response to the True Colours thread. It was a lot of fun putting um, all the records together and uh, showing them off to everybody. Hopefully you saw something that maybe you hadn't seen before. Um, so thanks for watching. Uh, thanks to all my new subscribers. You guys are great. Uh, really, really appreciate it. Uh, thanks to all the regulars as well. Uh, it's the week weekend's here, so get stuck in and have, have some fun, everybody. Uh, so again, thanks. Thanks for watching. Uh, oh, before I go, hey Maggie, um, you, may have, you may have noticed I've changed my hat uh, for you, um, St. Louis, come on. Um, before I go, I just wanted to say that, um, and say something that everybody already knows, uh, which is that you're a really great, great girl, um, extremely generous, extremely thoughtful, uh, extremely fun and extremely happy. So. Um, really happy that I know you um, and have gotten to know you. Um, so be well, take care, and uh, we'll see you soon.